be some proud faces out there representing their countries. Alan Smith represented England, brings back memories. Well, it does, because you've got your family in the crowd quite often, you know, they're listening to the national anthem while you're standing there, and uh, it's one of those days that you don't tend to forget. Very proud for these players. Our main feature today, Switzerland against England. We talk about the highest level that a player can achieve, Alan. You had the honour of playing for England, and we've got two national teams here today. Oh, it's always a special moment. You pull on your nation's shirt. Always a big game. This is no different. Here's the Switzerland lineup. Looking at the lineup, he's got all the components in place, hasn't he? The manager for the pressing style of play has been a feature of his team. Yeah, and uh, many an opponent has found it difficult to cope with. If your touch isn't spot on against this aggressive type of closing down, you're going to lose it in dangerous areas. Well, over 50 years since England were last world champions, but in 2017, their under-20 team became world champions and offered hope for the future. Yeah, and you just hope that uh, that transforms into the seniors in a few years' time. It's not always easy because it's difficult for these boys to attain a, a regular place in the Premier League. Let's have a look at the England lineup now. Ashley Young starts with Kieran Trippier as the wide defenders. Jordan Henderson plays with Delhi Alley in the, the centre of the park. Raheem Sterling starts up top with Harry Kane. Here's the kickoff, and the game is underway. Got to pass the ball a bit better than this if they're going to make progress, giving it straight away. Young, going forward well, Kay, with Raheem Sterling, it's a very good interception, and it's gone out for a throw, Cher, and that's going to be another throw in, here's Ali, now Kane. Deli Alley. Sterling. A great chance to go in front, but he's missed it. Incredible. But he can't believe it. His teammates can't either. Great interception. Now Lingard. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. Sherdan Shakiri. A chance for letting the shot go well sometimes these opportunities can come too early and maybe this is one of them yeah maybe just caught cold there wasn't expecting the chance to land at his feet and made a mess of it
Now Kane. Young. Sterling. And there's the cutback. And he bangs it away. Deli Alley. That's an easy cutout for the opposition, saw the pass coming. Jem Eiley. Mbola. Oh, they gave it straight to him, didn't they? We've given it straight to the opposition. Striding forward, purposefully. The man in the middle frustrated because that cross has gone straight behind. Berami, Gemayli, that's a fine tackle, no it's offside. given away Berami England in possession they've got the ball and he's a very willing runner Jesse Lingard and he shows that now must take the lead here no he's missed it how is this still level oh you'll be thinking about that one tossing and turning in bed tonight that was a bad miss And it is a, a header away and out of play. Shirdan Shakiri. Now he's looking for support. Trying to shoot here. To put them in front. Ebolo! Well, what a start to the game that would have been for them, Alan. The first goal coming so early, but not quite. But he's kicking himself. He can't believe he's missed from so close in two. with the goalkeeper and now the shot the ball's loose goalkeeper made the save but he couldn't hold it well that'll be a throw it's Jesse Lingard it goes out wide again they were right at the opposition then but it's broken down disappointingly Berami Jemaili. England getting the ball with good effort. Kane. Attacking team not happy about that offside call, but we can see it again here. Well, he is quick, this lad, and he can afford to give himself another yard. I think he's got the beating of these defenders.